Hey guys, been away for a bit, I thought I'd just quickly update you on Ripple, a few people getting really excited by Ripple, um, and just wanted to give you an update. Um, Ripple, 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 it made an inverted target uh, on this little fractal some time ago, and since then it's been turning around. People got really excited by this volume and this pump here, but you know, the way it works with these coins is, in my take, you don't make money by trying to call bottoms. Sure, you might have made a few beans if you could have got that, um, but you would have had to have got out. You've got a shooting star in the previous funnel here, so this is going to be a resistance zone that's going to hang on it. It's been flat and along the bottom for a long, long time. I've got a lot of Ethereum folks that have been holding on to Ethereum. You know, they married the coin because they made a bunch of money on it. Um, and you know they're still waiting for it to come back because they they're showing what loyal friends they are to the coin that gave them money uh, as if it's obliged to return and do it you don't need to be part of the first I'm happy to be late to all recovery situations be late to all recovery situations we've had countless false dawns here on ripple here here you even could have counted that in very early on that in that in this and then what happens you sit what about this and then you're giving back sure it stopped going down at the same rate um, and it's stalling at this level for quite a sustained period and it may well recover and start running again but you don't need that first five or ten percent there's other things that are going down with coins that are going up and the same goes if for a large degree to the guys that are in on ethereum you don't need to be holding the bag all the way down and then sitting out the bottoming waiting for it to go the opportunity cost in terms of what's gone on in other markets in the crypto realm is too high to sit and hold on something that has sold off cyclically quite badly since may all the way down and is now looking like it's grinding out a bottom and having a few bumps before pulling back um, so that's my take on Ripple. Um, I did a little bit of an antagonize YouTube, I was a bit mischievous, and I uh, questioned whether Ripple can survive and whether it can do that. Um, but that's mainly uh, to, I think, to provoke. Um, I think it probably will end up surviving and doing just fine, and it could well recover from these levels. But the point is, it's not performing as a coin at the moment particularly well and just because it stopped going down it's not a binary situation where that means it's therefore going up you can have long interim periods of pausing and then you can get further downside continuations or you can eventually get the reversal you're waiting for the question is opportunity cost so I'm repeating myself that's a quick updated message ripple still does not remain of great interest if you're on very short time frames you might have nicked a little bit of a bump but you're not truly in a new big uptrend um, so it's dangerous fishing grounds um, where there's much clearer coins and opportunities going around so we'll speak soon uh, and I'll be looking forward now that I'm back on grid again to updating you on a few uh, items in the crypto realm and in other spaces thank you for your attention likes and shares are appreciated if you feel that way inclined and otherwise uh, trade small trade safe and none of this is recommendation speak to you soon